it doesn't know when to pipe down. Some things are the same topside and bottom. Vander's talking about Vi here, and this comparison makes sense. Both characters at this point are extremely prejudiced, both characters want to go to war, come back too we even see very similar life situations, both characters have someone they want to protect at all costs. But they can't be that similar, right, because Vi turned out pretty different from Marcus. So I think the key to this difference emerges from looking at another difference between two other very similar characters, Vander and Grayson. Both are all about making compromises for peace, even if it's just for the present, but what's one thing Vander does that Grayson won't do? Vander is willing to sacrifice even himself for that peace, but Grayson is the one who refuses to go back to the council and say, I failed, I couldn't find anyone, they got away. She is not willing to put her head on the chopping block like Vander is, and whether or not that's a good solution does seem pretty nearsighted. It still answers our question. Vi had a role model who told her and showed her that sometimes you need to make that ultimate sacrifice for your morals, and Vi was willing to do that. Marcus, as we see in the scene with the grenade, was not able to do that, because that behavior was never modeled to him. That's my theory, adds a nice bit of nuance to Grayson's character.